Out of all the cars in the world, only a select few have made a big impact. Sure, the Toyota Aventus sells very well and gives you decent economy, lots of tech at a very low price, but it hasn't made a single impact in the world of cars. So here are the 8 most influential cars ever. Ben's Patton Motor Wagon Built in 1885, this incredible feat of engineering was the world's first automobile. It was created by a man called Carol Benz. It was unveiled on the 3rd of July 1886 on the Ringstrasse in Mannheim. It had a 954cc single cylinder engine which produced 3 brake horsepower. It seemed like a groundbreaking creation. However, not everyone was convinced. So one early August morning in 1888, Carol's wife, Bertha Benz, took one out on a 194km road trip to show the world how feasible the motor wagon was. And the rest is history. Ford Model T As a car, the Model T wasn't revolutionary one bit. It was just like any other car that was released in the early 1900s. So why is it on this list? Well, unlike all the other cars, the Model T was created by mastermind Henry Ford, who gained inspiration from the Oldsmobile Curved Dash, the world's first mass production car. But to make mass production work, the Model T was produced on a moving assembly line, which reduced build time and the number of people needed to work on one car. As a result, a Ford left the assembly line every three minutes. Between 1908 and 1927, 15 million Model Ts were produced, and the way cars were produced had changed forever. Volkswagen Beetle The Beetle was one of Hitler's great ideas. To try to get people to move around the country faster and more frequently, thanks to his new motor network, his idea was to make a car that was cheap, simple and practical. To do this, he hired top engineer Ferdinand Porsche to create him his people's car. In 1938, the Beetle was born. The Beetle became the Model T for the modern generation and sold over 25 million cars. It made the automobile available to the masses. Today, it holds the record for the world's longest running and most manufactured car ever. However, this right does not undo all of Hitler's wrongs. The Mini the Mini was an important milestone as it changed the way cars were designed forever. It was different as it was efficient, roomy, small enough to use in London traffic and fun to drive. It used a transversal front wheel drive layout which freed up space in the cabin so that more people and stuff can fit in it. The Mini was also very light which meant that although it wasn't that powerful, it was fast on the bendy roads. Most importantly, the Mini's layout paved the way for future Super Minis forever. Mercedes S-Class The S-Class is a super luxurious, comfortable saloon which gets you from point A to B with ease. However, this was not the S-Class's party trick. Instead, it became a car that would be the first to do a lot of things, like interior and exterior LED lighting. But mainly, it was the first car to have padding around the windows and steering wheel, airbags, anti-lock brakes, Autonomous driving in the form of radar guided cruise control, traction control, pre detection seatbelts, airbag seatbelts, center depressed headrests, a rainwater management system around the windscreen to improve visibility, and a bunch of other stuff you don't care about. Mitsubishi Eclipse Despite being made by a Japanese company, the Mitsubishi Eclipse was built in Illinois. It wasn't that special. It was basically a two-door Evo, as the Evo wasn't available in the US. It was a fun, fast and cool car, but what it did to the car industry was incredible. The Eclipse started the import tuner scene we know today. However, the Eclipse is still looked down upon as a creative scene it's not actually part of. But who cares? The creative scene you're probably part of. Toyota Prius The Prius is probably the most hated car ever. More hated than BMWs, more hated than Donald Trump, Justin Bieber, France and deluded branded feminists. <coughs> the Prius was one of the first hybrid cars. It used batteries that powered an electric motor which made the car more efficient and cleaner. It has encouraged many car makers to move to hybrid power to ensure a cleaner future for our planet. But then think of it this way, you wouldn't have the P1 LaFerrari 918 without it. <coughs> Toyota 
Tesla Model S Taking the hybrid evolution even further, the Tesla Model S was the world's first pure electric luxury car. It was comfortable, practical, clean, expensive, but most of all, it was cool. The Model S was the first mainstream electric car that was problem free and nice to look at. Before the Model S, electric cars were ugly, unreliable and useless. Annoyingly, Tesla and the Model S have changed that stereotype forever.